I'm just doing a quick book review on the book Sigils of Power for and Transformation by Adam Blackthorne from the Gallery of Magic. This is one of those mental magic books that's been accepted by the <clears throat> most of the mindfulness groups and others. They are just simple drawings for change that you can meditate upon and change your thoughts and such. And it contains 111 different sigils of power. And it seems to work uh, well for those who just want to change their patterns of thought and uh, things like that, and um, it's been getting a lot of praise. I personally need a feel of something spiritual, a little bit of danger, a little bit of forbidden, to find a motivation to do things. That is my drug of choice, is that little bit of spirituality and all that f things. But it's a well-written book. And it's there are beautiful sigils in it. And if you want to learn how to practice magic, this is probably the safest way to learn how to gaze at the sigil and change your emotional states and get it over and done with and get familiar with the simple rituals before you go into heavier. So... This one is a positive, once again, and a kind and gentle book. So this book reviews seems to be kind of gentle and kind, at least for these books. So, bye for now.